Hello, welcome to my channel. So we have a John Doe found June 19th, 1986 in Atlanta, Georgia. He was just 25 to 40 years old. Estimated PMI was just weeks. White Caucasian male, 5 foot 6, estimated 120 pounds. Estimated. He was found beneath tires in an illegal dumping area. Dark brown hair, about 5 inches in length. Dark brown hair under his arms, blue jeans, brown belt, white socks, high heel boots with basket weave top, a size seven and a half. So if you have any family, loved ones, friends that went missing around that time, please contact authorities. Make sure they're listed in NamUs. If you can't get them listed in NamUs, see if you can't get them in the Doe Network or the Charlie Project. And there was this man, he went missing this all the way in Mississippi. It's pretty far away. I don't think it could be him because it's so far away. But I'm listening to him anyway. He went missing around January 1986. He was just 34 years old. 5 foot 5 to 5 foot 10. They don't know how tall he was. But yet they say his estimated weight was 155 to 165. He's not been seen since January 1st, 1986. And I don't know who saw him last. Mustache, otherwise military shaven or possibly short stable or stubble or shadow from being off duty for a few days. For his facial hair, brown hair, brown eyes. Possible military accessories such as web belt or military ID. Was wearing civilian clothing during the night of his disappearance. Ah, 1978 for Granada. One of the arresting OSPD officers, Danny Smith, stated he purchased a vehicle on a salvage bond from two unknown individuals in approximately March 1986. March 1986? But he's been missing since January 1986. So, like I said, I don't know that that could be him, but I'd like to have a missing person listed with the John Doe so that, you know, you... I think it raises the empathy level. And so anyway, if you have any idea who this might be, please contact authorities and let them know. And like I said, if you have a loved one or friend or someone that went missing in the area of Atlanta, Georgia, around that time, check and make sure they're in NamUs. And if they're not, see if you can't get investigators to enter them into NamUs. And if not, see if you can't get them on the Doe Network or the Charlie Project or just all three. Um, don't forget to pray for his family and his loved ones. Feel free to leave comments and have a blessed day. Bye-bye.